uh, welcome back so today i'm going to teach you about an app called droid so we have been hearing about the droid free vpn data so uh, those people using airtel this is the trick so you have to download the droid app from google play store and um, it's well installed in your application if you are search show you the the real application go to google play store and search for droid vpn droid vpn this is the real application of droid vpn as you can see i myself i already have the application and there are things that the new thing about this application they have fixed the payment error but in this case don't worry you are not going to have any payment stuff because this is all free this is the legit website for droid vpn so after downloading it open the application then make sure you create your account uh you go through the email verification stuff make sure you are connected uh, here you can see it has even connected itself so click here then tap here on account this area tap there on account then because we are going uh make uh, tap there in order to make sure that you have the real account we are going to use this setting area so these are our main areas of concern so tap in your account click save or login if you know that you don't have an account there so what then click in settings so when you click in settings come here on the first step here that's the first step click make it allow there if you have any configuration files you have to insert them here so as of now we are not, we are not going to put any file uh, now go on the second step this area click it then make sure this part is switched on switch this one on send http headers on tcp send http headers when connecting connecting via tcp tcp make sure it's on let's continue then click that side I'll leave that the way it is don't tap anywhere in this link leave it the way it is click back proxy settings don't enable them leave it and enabled leave it and enabled don't tap anywhere click back back again then here on the additional settings uh, if you have, i mean here on the additional settings tap don't enable this part don't enable this part don't enable this part all these parts should be left don't tap anywhere don't enable anything go back VPN connection settings are here. Go on VPN connection settings. Tap it open. Click this area. I mean, turn it on. The run as a root run Android VPN engine as a root. Use a built in VPN service API to set up tunnel. Collect compressed data tunnel through VPN. Turn it on. Allow traffic to bypass VPN destined for local networks. 
allow it then turn on mtu size and the minimum up successful connection turn it on so make sure everything here is turned on on the tunnel settings make sure everything here is turned on before we continue you can subscribe to my channel open the notification button so that when i post a new video you will be able to access it then scroll down on the the, the above we are the tunnel settings this we are the tunnel settings now we are moving down to the connection settings so in the connection settings turn on the auto minimize minimize up on successful connection always connect the vpn when device is online auto reconnect when connection drops or fails make sure all these three parts are enabled make sure all these three parts under the connection settings are enabled so that your android app works well to give you free data then move down to the device specific fixes and loads needed do not enable anything here don't enable anything here on droid don't 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 enable anything here so come back uh, uh here on the let me see that stuff we are going to click here on the udp settings click open <laughs> then make sure uh, turn turn on this udp port testing enable port testing before connecting turn it on turn automatically scan ports when the configured remote udp port is not working turn all that stuff on choose udp mode choose to mode one here are you udp mode one settings tap in the t counter they are saying accept value is 1 to 250 but make it excess and move for 5000 put 5000 there 5000 here not this they want 255 then click ok then come back on the other t counter value put 04 here the value is 04 Put zero four here. Don't mind about this stuff. Come back. So this is the main part here. The local UDP port. Please get focused on that area because this is the most part now that we are going to be using this one this is the main part local udp port local udp port local udp port when where our vp can't will or blind so open it then set it to i remove the other figure that is being shown to you and set it to 80 80 click ok please uh, that is the figure 80 80 type it there and we are good to go ok tap ok then move up put 80 82 here also don't please this is the main stuff put 80 80 then okay i mean put 80 80 as the figure here and 80 80 as the figure above these two parts inside in the figures put 80 80 then after that we are good to go come back back to settings then click on this connection stop on and it will show you that it's connecting here where well, you have to click here when it brings that the server is full click again 
you have to be patient because when it's connected you have to enjoy the free data without any interruption you have hard hard turn on wire turn wire turn is working too but droid is beating it massively so you have to use this stuff for your benefit click on start and it will start at, uh, connecting above so when it's connected you are free and you'll be uh, using your data you will not be using your data of course it will be free super free internet super free these are the servers you will remain connecting start connecting and these are settings are for airtel but it works on mtn2 but a, a bit for mtn it's a bit sloppy on and off so airtel users you are good to go subscribe to nabo ug hustle nabo 256 nabo 256 subscribe and share thanks for watching let's meet in the next video if you have any question please bring it down the comment section as i will be able to highlight and give you the best information you want about this application